content and many surface sinkholes. So the discovery was made after William Campbell felt a current of cool air coming from the bottom of a large sinkhole. And this is very unusual because it was a hot August day. So why would they be feeling cool air um, from a sinkhole? So they dug and they dug at that sinkhole until they made the hole big enough that they could actually enter through. So they entered through this area marked by the black cross right up here. And then they slid down this hill. And the first formation to catch their eye was the Washington <laughs> Column right here, which is named after our first president, George Washington. And I do have a few guidelines for you all today. Um, the first is the most important. Please do not touch or handle any of the caverns formations because we actually have natural oils and salts in our hands that can stop the growth of the caverns over time. And the second guideline is to please do not sit or lean on the lower hand railings um, because these are mostly meant as a guide and they can't support body weight. Um, our tour today is going to be about a mile and a quarter long, and we'll be walking for about an hour to an hour and ten minutes. Um, so before we go to our next stop, does anyone have any questions? All right, then you all can follow me down to our next stop, which is at the amphitheater.